Jimmy Black really pioneered a change in pharmaceutical medicine. Jim is a hugely intelligent man, so he's just bursting with ideas. Jim was uh, a medical genius, a, pharm uh, a pharmaceutical genius, a man who understood the body. A British scientist has won this year's Nobel Prize for Medicine. Sir James Black of King's College in London shares the prize with two American research scientists. Sir James developed drugs that have treated millions of sufferers from heart disease, high blood pressure and peptic ulcers. A colleague said that Sir James had relieved more suffering than thousands of doctors in a lifetime at the bedside. <laughs> well, I didn't believe it to begin with. And uh, when I did begin to believe it, uh, I felt quite sick. Well, there you are. That was a curious reaction. <laughs> the committee paid tribute to Sir James, who they said was ahead of his time in research and ideas. Well, I think he's a pioneer in medicines research. You know, he's the guy who's discovered two blockbusters. And he's the guy whose uh, efforts have been mimicked by many, many people, leading to the discovery of even more blockbusters. So I think his methods have been practiced universally and that has led in many ways and contributed to what we see as our modern medicines. Jim actually gave rise to the initial blockbusters uh, and that changed the world of, of pharmaceutical ratings. We saw the growth of big farmers in particularly in the 70s and 80s when there was a wealth of productivity, a great deal of wealth created, but for her mankind, an enormous change in the quality of our lives. Nothing, nothing will keep us together. Jim was the best colleague I've ever had in my long career in the pharmaceutical industry. And I frequently used to think on a Friday, God, it's two days to Monday before we can get back together in the lab. It was that exciting. Just for one day. We can look at Jim to say, what did Jim do in terms of his science and in the culture that he created around him to have the power of basic research translated into a final therapeutic outcome? I have no doubts in my mind that as an individual, Jim Black has made a bigger contribution to medicine than probably anyone else in what he did with the beta blockers and subsequently H2 antagonists. They probably transformed more lives than uh, most other inventions in the last 50 years. Mm -hmm.